So in my last video, I showed you how to generate .tik files, which is a ticket file. But I never showed you how to actually use them, so you might be wondering what that is. A uh, ticket file allows you to re-download um, stuff from the eShop, so that's just a basic overview of what it is. So to do this, you're going to need FBI. So a general thing to keep in mind with the 3DS is it's best to always have updated software. You always want the latest of the homebrew application and stuff. Just never the latest 3DS version. You always want to stay on 9.2 whenever you can. So let's launch FBI. And FBI uses mostly the bottom screen, so I'll just move to the bottom screen. So from here we're going to go into SD. There's so many options over here that, like, we just can't go over all of them. We're just going to go into the SD, and this will allow you to do all of the basic functions, like installing CIAs and installing tickets. So let's go to our CI Angel folder, inside the tickets folder, and then here's our ticket file. So we can do any of these options. We're going to install it. So yes install finish so we can press ok and that's all we needed to do now we can exit out of here by pressing the home button and we can close out of that so now let's go to the eShop so let's launch the eShop And this usually takes a while for me to load, so I'll just pause the video until it loads. Alright, so it finally loaded. So now we're going to go to the search bar, and then we're going to search the ticket that we just installed. So ours was Terraria, so... So let's just hit OK. And we want the actual game. So here's the actual game. So it's 1999, and I only have 46 cents on my account. And then you might notice it says go to re-download screen, even though I've never bought in the software in my life. So let's click on that. Previous is, previously purchased items can be re-downloaded at no extra cost. So I've never, I've never bought in this, so this is pretty cool that you can like re-download stuff without actually even buying it directly from Nintendo. So I guess this isn't quite as illegal as downloading a CIA from a random website. This is actually using Nintendo servers and downloading something. So yeah, um, I guess that's it for this video. This showed you how to install ticket files and download, see, uh, ins download um, games from the eShop using the ticket file. So yeah, um, I might have a few more videos coming up involving the, all this recent stuff that's been coming out, so stay tuned for those.